Resting on the couch. More fucking notifications on the phone. You know how they say your life flashes before your eyes when you die? <laughs> that shit's real talk. Saw it all, huh? Yeah. There I am, bleeding out. And suddenly I'm getting the third degree from Matsugane-san. Back when I was still just a rookie. Captain Hamura stares me down like, time to lose that pinky. And then, Higashi starts crying for me. Oh, if I'm gonna go, I ought to get a better final scene than that shit, right? Right? I'm sure it'll be rosier when the time comes for real. Glad you pulled through, man. That bastard Soma, though. Next time, he's fucked. We could have avenged Sawa-sensei if it weren't for that stupid ambush. Well, you didn't tell the cops about him, did you? Had to give the cops a statement, so I did. With a generous side of bullshit. That'll get you busted, you know. I'm joking. All I said was the truth. That I got knifed by the same twisted fuck who got Sawa-sensei. In that case, it's only a matter of time until Soma's arrested. So for I now, doubt it. we'll go after Kawana, the piece that ties it all together. We just have to find him before RK does. Kawana, huh? He's on my shit list too, just so you know. People like huh? that rarely Kuwana have anything have bad coming to them. They usually take themselves out right. at the last second. It's probably because you were looking into Mikoshiba. Because they don't want to face the repercussions or the, or the uh, consequences of their actions. The agency, huh? I wouldn't say that. Just like on Judgment. Still. If you guys have watched it. If not, moment, an I also have it as well on this channel. Shape I'm in. So go check it out. Just focus on getting better. Tsukuma will stop by later, too. What? Tsukiyura gonna give me the cold shoulder? He and I are off to question Mamiya. He said he'd drive us from Ijincho and everything. Bop, 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 bop. Going to Yokohama, na na na. You know what? Fuck this. Taxi cab. If you got the money, use a taxi. Saves you a lot of time. Doge. So we off to see Mamiya? I'm ready whenever you are. Hell yeah. Let's get to it. Yep, let's go. Alright, let's do this. If your theory is accurate, then Mamiya was involved in both Kawai and Mikoshiba's murders. And even if that's off, we can at least learn more about Kawana-san as a teacher. I cut my mustache a little bit because it was getting too long getting in my mouth and getting all nasty from stuff that I drink and eat and from the cigarettes it's just gross and then if I lick my mustache or something like that to keep from whatever's on it from dripping on the floor or on yeah. my shirt hi it's Yagami you know I, I by with lick it the other day. and then I end up swallowing what I licked I have just a few more so questions. So that just goes to my stomach and makes it hurt. You told me the last visit would be your only one. Seriously, why do you keep showing up here It doesn't do any good to shave it, because I mean it still comes back anyway. It's never I gonna leave. I should mention, I'm here today as a detective, not a lawyer. So it's just what? when the shit grows so fast, it's just a pain in the ass Europe. to manage it. He's with an agency called Yokohama 99. Never heard of him. He's based in Ijincho. He's working a case. Maybe you saw it on the news? The murder of Serio High teacher Yokosawa, killed in her own apartment. You and Sawa-san were classmates in high school, is that correct? After leaving Kurokawa 13 years ago, Sawa-san moved to Ichincho to teach. Uh, are you still there? What is it you want? 
I haven't seen Yoko-chan since graduation. Now go. You're barking up the wrong tree. Maybe you'll remember Kitakata-sensei then. I ran into him at Sawa-sensei's home right before the murder. He was your homeroom teacher at Kurokawa, but resigned after the Mitsuo Kusamoto incident. Just like you, he appears to be connected to Sawa-san. So why am I being singled out? Can't you just ask someone else? Believe me, it's a long list. But right now, we're here to find out how Sawa-san got mixed up in all this. You two weren't necessarily on bad terms, were you? And if I had to say, we weren't on the best terms either. Uh, how convenient. Because that's a perspective I'd like to hear more about as well. My husband will be home soon. Can you keep it quick? I'll give him my best shot. Exactly. Thanks for hearing us out. Now hold on just a moment. <laughs> huh. I wonder what's going on. You don't think she bolted, do you? Mm, wouldn't count on it. Should we ring again? Sorry to keep you waiting. I just wanted to clean up a little. Is your son home today? No, she was trying to buy time. He's at English school right now. I have to pick him up soon. She didn't fucking clean. Her house was Doesn't probably already clean to begin with. That? You said he'd be home soon, right? Excuse me. She was just trying to kill no time until her her husband got home. <laughs> to where she Sorry. didn't have to talk to him. Didn't mean to pry. Well, what is it you want to ask? Have you been in contact with Kitakata Sensei lately? I haven't. He's someone I'd rather not have in my life. Are you surprised that he stayed in Ijincho after resigning from the school? No, not really. How about the fact that now he's using an alias? I had no clue. But again, he has nothing to do with me. Mm hmm. Do you remember Mitsuru Kusumoto? Yes, we were classmates in high school. He jumped off the school's roof after his classmate Shinya Kawai bullied him. I hear he's still in a coma, 13 years later. Weren't you going to ask me about Yoko-chan? I was, but there seemed to be an awful lot of Kurokawa graduates surrounding this case. And strangely enough, they were all in your class. Kitakata sensei being the prime example, as well as a guy named Akaike-san. Remember him? Well, you're right. We were in the same class. And would you say you're all familiar with Mitsuru Kusumoto's situation? Yes, but that's not a warm memory for any of us. I understand. I'm sure it's not. Oh shit, here we go. Last one. The groping was orchestrated, right? Excuse you? When Akihiro Ihara grabbed you on the train, you were in on that, weren't you? The whole thing was a conspiracy, staged to play out as it did. You need to leave. Right now. Dude, what gives? No one would even think to consider a predator and his victim could be accomplices. It's unheard of. But if it was to establish a murder alibi, that's another story considering how much lighter the sentence is. That way, Ihara got away with killing Mikoshiba, paying only a fraction of the price. But as luck would have it, proving it is going to require you to cooperate with us now. If you don't get up this second, I am calling the police. I mean it! It took me quite a long time to figure out how you and Ihara were connected. But once I learned Yokosawa attended Kurokawa, it all started falling into place. She was in your homeroom class. She looked after Toshio Ohara. She was the link to everyone. <sighs> but just before I could ask her about any of this, she was murdered by Kamurocho gang. That same gang had been hunting your old teacher, 
Kitakata Sensei. What is it you want from me? Lamia-san, do you have any idea where Kitakata Sensei could be? He may be Kawana the Handyman, but he hasn't answered his work line since Sawasan's murder. I don't know. He was my teacher a decade ago. I barely remember his face. Well, I'm willing to wager Kitakata Sensei still remembers yours. I'll prove it right now. Oh, God. I'm pretty sure that's the right one. See for yourself. No. This was recorded at Kurokawa Academy 13 years ago. Feeling nostalgic yet? Rut row. It was well hidden. Your Kitakata sensei had it on a USB drive. He really didn't want this thing being seen. The most interesting part is the date. It's the very same day Mitsuru Kusumoto jumped off the school roof. And hanging out in the back, we see you, laughing and cheering right along with the other bullies. Guess it's safe to say it's a good thing your family wasn't home. Wouldn't exactly want them seeing this, would we? Has this video come up? Has Kitakata Sensei ever mentioned to you that he had it? Please. I take that as a yes. Please delete it. Considering the angle, I get the feeling that this was recorded in secret. And based on your reaction, did you even know it existed? <sighs> you know what happened to Mitsuru-kun. He's been in a coma ever since what you did to him that day. But still, only one of you took the fall. Shinya Kawai took all the blame. Well... Sort of, being that he got fired, Kitakata-sensei took heat, too. Still, you all just moved right along with your lives. You've even got happy little families. What? Are you expecting someone? Amiya-san? I knew what happened someday. What do you mean? All the people involved are trying to keep everyone silent. And they think that she's speaking, so they're trying to shut her up. Let's kick the ass. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Well, this turned into a shit show. Would you look at that? Our old friend Akaike-san showed up to play a part. So you are all working together. What should we do with them? They're the jerks who hurt Tsukumo-kun, right? Break every finger on their hand, it still won't make you even. Come on, they may have more on the way. I have an old haunt in mind we moved this to, and Mamiya-san's coming with. Huh? Let's not cause a scene, okay? I'd hate for a finger to slip and post this video. Wouldn't it be in her best interest to go along with him anyway? Like, aren't those other guys, like, trying to kill her? And if she left with them, I mean, she would kind of be safe. Regardless of whether or not she wants to go or whatever. Personal jail, Yagami. What makes you think you can keep bringing captives here? Well, it's the safest spot we know. Doesn't it feel good to be such a reliable friend? Yeah, Higashi, be cool. We won't be around long. Be cool? You think time's the issue? 
This is about respect, man. What's your call? We kicking him out? Oh, quick bit of news, Higashi-san. Kaito-san got shanked in Yokohama. What? What the fuck? Kaito Aniki? By who? Once we're done explaining, let me introduce you to Mamiya-san first. She called up her friends to come after us just a little bit ago. Yeah, and I'd do it again. I don't give a shit about that. What happened to Aniki? You better have paid him back already, Yagami. <clears throat> Fuck those RK assholes. And how could Aniki have let him get to him like that? Now that Higashi-san's up to speed, should we get to it? I imagine Mamiya-san doesn't want to drag this out. What do you intend to do with me? First, you'll tell us everything you know. We'll decide how to deal with you afterward. <sighs> Why do we have to talk to this fucking cunt? Like, seriously? Didn't we already talk to her? I swear.